Good evening to all of you and uh, I'm deeply thankful to all of you for taking your time and joining us today in this important event. Uh, career development and career progression, I think something which is very close to all of uh, us and, and this is something which we start thinking about as soon as we qualify and join uh, different organizations, how to build a successful career, what is success, how to be more successful in life in your, and also in your professional career is a question which always bothers us all the time and people are always looking towards tips and guidance as to how to make a successful journey in their career ladders. Uh, and we actually at SRC thought that the subject uh, which we should also discuss in our seminars and our forums that we normally hold for our professional members. And therefore, we requested Mr. Anwar Goplani, who is a very senior person as far as the HR field is concerned. He actually has worked across various multinational and national organizations. And presently, he actually head, heads uh, the HR department in the Central Depository Company of Pakistan, a very prestigious organization and a lot of responsibility that he holds uh, in terms of human resource management in that organization. We are very thankful to him that he has taken his time for the Institute and to, to give us uh, some guidance and also to give him uh, uh, some uh, perspective about the career progression and development and the thoughts and the, uh, and, and the trends that are relevant in this area. So, without taking much of your time, I just request Mr. Anwar Goplani to take the uh, uh, the fee um, <coughs> uh, to take it from here. And so, please welcome Mr. Anwar Goplani for the seminar. Thank you very much, Mr. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Assalamu alaikum, ladies and gentlemen. After such a heavy introduction by Arsalan, lot of responsibility has been placed on my shoulder. I don't know, by the end of the session, I'll be able to deliver what has been uh, said or what is being expected out of me. Let's see what comes out of it. I see a lot of young, old and bright faces. Interesting. You all have been following a career, isn't it? Right from the beginning, when we start our education at the age of six, five or seven, we follow a path. And at some point in time, words are put in our mouth by our mentors, by our parents, by our elders, that what will you become? Someone says that I will doctor, someone says that I will become a lawyer, fala fala fala. So from there, right from that point onward, we start visualizing, foreseeing our career. Today, as I said earlier, lot of bright faces with lot of experience. So those who are with lot of experience have got or are in their mid of career or moving towards peak of their career. And there are lot of young faces which may have been struggling to establish their career. So we'll discuss today from both the aspect. But to begin with, let me put up a basic question. When Arsalan and Junaid asked me to come and talk to you guys, 
the basic, the very fundamental question came into mind is look at this question. Are you happy with your uh, career? Can you guys raise your hand if you are happy? Let me, let me help you. I have, I mean, this is not the first time that I'm asking this question to the audience. There are many forums over whom I have asked this question and the feelings is always mixed. Even to the extent that people first want me to define what do I mean by career. So let me help you to decide for yourself whether or not you are happy with your career. Just think that you woke up in the morning and you are finding it difficult to get out of the bed. How many people are there who need to push themselves to get out of the bed? Raise your hands. All right, there are a couple of people. How many people are there who have bunked from the office for a day or two during the last month? And surprising. Well, those are the symptoms. Those are the symptoms that clearly spells out that whosoever finding it difficult to push himself out of the bed in the morning is a clear symptom that he is not interested in going to the office. He is not excited. He is not charged. He doesn't feel like going. Similarly, bunk marna bhi aise hi hota hai. Daftar se agar aap bunk marte hai, which means, which clearly exhibit lack of interest. Lack of interest in career. Now, that was, and this question particularly, and those two questions that I help you assist, were pertaining to your life. Okay? Now, specifically, let's pop down to the career aspect. Ye wo sawalat hain time and again almost every one of us is confronted with such like questions. What is my career? Ji, jis direction mein mein ja raha hoon, wo direction mein liye suitable hai bhi hai nahi. Even, even people at mid of their career challenge themselves and ask I am not getting the satisfaction. I am not getting the satisfaction. I am not getting the satisfaction. So, this question is there. What is my career? For youngsters, when will I be promoted? For them, perhaps the career means the next movement. Kedi promotion ka For some, why? Have I not been considered for that position? Every year, almost in every organization, there is a song and dance party, which is known as appraisal. Andy? People who get good increments, people who are promoted, song and dance party. Every year, in almost every organization, this party goes on. Those who've been awarded and rewarded, they enjoy the party. And those who have not come up with this question. Although I need the requirement of the position, I don't know. Kyo mujhe promote nahi kiya? Perhaps, perhaps, parchi. Ya wo jo cafeteria mein gossip hoti hai, yaar wo to bada chahita hai. Uzi ke bhaag lage hai, baaki hum to sab saute le hai. Ye wo guktugu hai, jo private corners ke andar, almost everybody does. It doesn't make any difference at which level you are. It doesn't make any difference. At senior levels, uska guftugu ka context, aur uska paraya dousra hota hai. At junior levels, in this crude term, jo mene aapko batai, ye kaano se suni hoi baate hai. Jo over a span of 30 years, I listen to them. Then the final question. Then the final question: What should I do 
to attract the attention of management. What is the problem? So, we will talk about this today. So, what you should do to get attracted and to get what you want and to be there where you feel you should have been. Actually, time is a bit shorter. So, I would suggest if you have a question, so please keep on asking. We may not get the uh, time towards the end to respond to you in detail. So, whatever the question up, up, you can ask. And I would rather prefer the interactive sessions. So, there are, these are the questions so, Mukhtarim stages but low post reaction. Now, so, sir, it's the last uh, one. I am working okay. I am uh, very good, giving time, doing all the things. But sometimes a little mistake, take the attention of the management that uh, you are not working. Although I am very good to the organization, everything is okay, give my time, extra time, Saturday, Sunday, all these things. But sometimes many feel that you have not done this thing, therefore you are not in good book of the management. Unfortunately, ये होता भी अप्रेजल के आसपास ही होगा। इसको कहते हैं, इसको कहते हैं रीसेंसी इफेक्ट। ठीक है ठीक। और इनवेरिएबली इस किस्म की जो वो हो रही होती हैं चीजें, वो हो ही रही होती हैं अप्रेजल से दो एक महीने पहले, एक महीना पहले, और फिर सारा साल जो है वो बड़ी पुरस्कृत लगी बैठी रहती है। ठीक आइए हम इसके आगे चल के बात करते हैं। Hold your breath and we are going to talk कि करना क्या चाहिए। इस किस्म के सिचुएशंस में। तो ये सवाल था, उसको हमने किया। Now move on. What do we mean by career? I don't think we need to go into the academic definition of word career. If you guys feel like going into the academic definition, it's very simple, yeah. आपका जो वर्क लाइफ है, 36 इयर्स, 38 इयर्स और व्हाटेवर इट इस, बिफोर 60 व्हाटेवर योर वर्क लाइफ इस, उसके अंदर डिफरेंट स्टेजेस, डिफरेंट टर्न्स, डिफरेंट कर्व्स आर नोन एस करियर। एक लेडर होता है, अगर आप उसको वो लेते हैं, तो वो लेडर है एंड यू कीप ऑन क्लाइमिंग अप एंड अप एंड अप मूविंग so that is what academic terms के अंदर वो है और फिर ये सारे जितने भी अल्फाज हैं career path, career development, career management, personal growth, personal development, all these words are being used in the corporate world more or less interchangeably होते होंगे अगर आप किसी company का succession plan उठा के देखें तो उसके अंदर उसके specific meaning होते होंगे but in general or common parlance, we use these words interchangeably. Aye, in sub chizon ko, let's walk through. Career ko, hum select kaise kar rahe hote hain? Ya hum us tak pohunte kaise hain? Ya hum uski search kaise kar rahe hote hain? Jab hum is process mein hote hain, to humari apni khwaishe hoti hain. Humari apni chahat hoti hain. जो भी मैं करना चाहता हूं वो आई नो कि मुझे करना क्या है सिमिलरली उसी डायरेक्शन के अंदर मैंने एक एजुकेशन अक्वायर की हुई है उस डायरेक्शन के अंदर मैं मूव कर रहा हूं फिर आई हैव गॉट प्रेशर्स फ्रॉम फैमिली कि फैमिली एक्सपेक्टेशंस भी हैं देन सोसाइटी की एक्सपेक्टेशंस भी हैं ठीक है जी और अगर मैं कहीं कोई अच्छा स्टूडेंट रहा हूं तो वो एक खुद ब खुद एक एक्सपेक्टेशन और हो जाती है कि भाई जनाब ये करियर के अंदर भी इज गोइंग टू do good, ठीक है जी? तो इन सारी चीजों को मिला के एक डब्बे के अंदर बंद कर दें और उसको हिला के और जब हम फेंकते हैं तो हम कहते हैं this is what my career is निकलता क्या है? ये बड़ा मुश्किल है कहना कि निकलता क्या है उसके अंदर से? Is this a career? A job with multinational or a large scale organization where you have got 
a beautiful, sophisticated office 